हेलो एवरी वन आई एम जुनीत खालिद वेलकमिंग बैक यू टू आवर यूट्यूब चैनल टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट लेटेक्स एंड लर्न हाउ टू स्टार्ट अ डॉक्यूमेंट इन लेटेक्स एंड हाउ टू राइट मैथमेटिकल इक्वेशन इन लेटेक्स बाई यूजिंग ओवर लीव सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड बिफोर स्टार्टिंग आई विल टेल यू अबाउट लेटेक्स एक्चुअली लेटेक्स इज अ टूल यूज टू क्रिएट अ प्रोफेशनल लुकिंग डॉक्यूमेंट्स इट इज बेस्ड ऑन द आइडिया you only have to focus on the content of your document and the computer will take care of the formatting in latex users can enter a plain text and latex take care of the rest you can also write a uh, different type of research papers books journals articles and other research papers in latex so let's start a new project blank project write sample create so it has been loading created now you can see on the left side the source here just leave the first two and from here you can change the title author and date title sample document and you have to compile from here you can also compile by using control and enter sample document sample it will change into a sample document now you can also change the name of the author junaid khalid compile so here it is you can also change the date you can use hashtag today so if you are downloading the file tomorrow or you have to work for 2 4 days and then download the file it will automatically change to the date so let's begin begin document it is the body part make title you can make title over here and it will be appear before the sections like mathematical equation expressions and it will appear here so it is basically the title part so you can also create sections let's create first section as basic equation basic equation and it will appear instead of introduction compile basic equation now we are going to write pythagorean theorem begin equation and we will write pythagorean theorem x square plus y square equals to z square and it will it will enter with and equation and let's compile control enter or you can click here compile here it is our pythagorean theorem in latex so in this way you can write basic equations in latex let's take another example in physics the mass energy equivalence is described by the equation begin equation e equals to mc for square and compile control enter e is equal to mc mc square so which was discovered by albert einstein in 1905 so in this way we can write equations basic equations in latex now create another section for subscript and superscript if the expressions contain long subscripts or superscripts then we you, we need to be collected in braces so let's start with braces bracket x power 2 alpha and 2 oblique alpha minus 1 equals to y ij plus y underscore ij underscore represents subscript and this is close and compile control enter it will appear here so this is 2 alpha is the subscript and y ij ij is superscript let's zoom and it will be clear here so in this way we can write superscript and subscript in latex i j is 
subscript so the next section is about brackets and parentheses section brackets and parentheses so brackets and parentheses can be written in latex as let's take compile let's take an example this is and start f equals to g parentheses fraction more big fraction m1 underscore and m2 m underscore m underscore 2 and no 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 uh, we have to write m1 and m2 in the same bracket let's cut and just here and here ask here and the base is close compile so here is our uh, we have to close uh, on bracket and is closed uh, yeah. and compile control enter so here it is here we see the size of the brackets are not complete uh, so we can use write oblique write and oblique wrap before and after uh, before the parenthesis so compile so it can fit so it can fit in both nominator and denominator same is the case with other uh, brackets and let's take an example of brackets like uh, left uh, start uh, left bracket fraction public fraction n uh, let's it is n and again this fraction parenthesis left sorry left parenthesis uh, fraction u and p u p and we are going to close right parenthesis minus n plus n minus n n plus n and right bracket and n plus n bracket and then we have to we have to close it here yes and right bracket and this is closed compile here in this way we can write uh, brackets or we can use brackets in the equations by using a latex in or leaf so we can learn today about subscript and superscript brackets and parentheses and how to write basic equation in latex <coughs> So that's it for today. In the next video, we will talk about uh, uh, matrices, aligning equation, and operators by in latex by using uh, overleaf. Till then, take care. Goodbye.